Hello everyone and welcome to Wishes and Is. Hello everyone, if you are new here, please subscribe if you enjoy the video content. Today I am going to be unboxing. I'm really excited. I have ordered a new Loungefly bag. So you may have seen my one from a couple of weeks ago with the Ewok bag. The obsession didn't stop there and I may have decided it was time to order another Loungefly. Now, this is amazing. This is a small world bag. You may have seen this advertised before. You may have seen this on Loungefly or another website. I absolutely adore this bag and I'm hoping that it lives up to its standards in person. I ordered this bag from someone from Facebook, so it's brand new, and the lady who is selling it was just selling it on. It has arrived today in this beautiful Minnie Mouse style packaging. The lady who I shipped it from as well, she's really lovely, really friendly. She's not a business owner or anything like that, she's just selling off what she purchased when she was in Disney World in Florida. So I'm not going to leave a link or anything for her down below, but if she ever does watch this, you were so lovely. Um, I wish you could be my mum while I get to keep my actual mum because I love my mum very much. She <laughs> purchased three bags for her daughters and gave them to them when she was back. And her daughters told her the bags weren't cool because they all had the same bag, which is the one that I am about to open. Sadly, the wrapping did get a little bit torn, but that's to be expected. She also sent it second class sign for, but it came really quickly. And I'm gonna have to be careful not to show you this side because it's got my address on and it's so big, I can't actually get rid of it. I feel like it's my birthday all of a sudden. Oh, she's got lovely wrapping in there as well. And something, a free small gift. It smells very minty. Do you know what? I'm gonna make a guess. I'm gonna say these are mint matchmakers, which I would love. They're mint matchmakers. Oh my gosh, bless that. And they're suitable for vegetarians as well, which means Simon and I can enjoy these. Thank you so much. You are lovely and that's just, that's just really nice, especially because she was so lovely and talkative as well. I can see it, I'm so happy. Ta -da! So it is still in its original Disney packaging as well. It says on the back, small world, backpack, Disney item. How amazing. Oh, it's so lovely and cute and I love it. So I think I said in one of my recent videos as well, anything with a gold accent, I just absolutely fall for. And this is just covered in gold accents. It's a Disney Parks lounge fly, so it's exclusive to the parks. It has the original price tag still on that said it was $75. I actually got this for a bargain. The seller sold it to me for £50, so thank you so much. And it has got an original Disney Parks tag on it as well. Now, the one thing I haven't seen about this bag that I really, really, really am looking forward to seeing is the inside. So lounge fly bags are really famous for having really lovely insides the lining is so lovely and different and suits the style of a bag to the t so it has got more paper inside to keep it nice and bulky ah i'm actually surprised so unlike the ewok bag this bag doesn't have a massive tag on the inside and the pattern actually continues from the outside so it's the same pattern which i love to pieces i think it's lovely anyway um, the tags on the inside as well do again say it's a Disney Parks lounge fly and also says that it's simulated leather which is really important to me because I don't want a leather bag. Straps are absolutely gorgeous, so lovely and gold and the bag just has a nice smell. I don't know if that's from the seller's house or whether it's just the bag in general but it's so nice. The detailing on the bag is absolutely ridiculous. And I think any fans of It's a Small World will really, really enjoy this. Again, it's got the typical lounge fly sides, so you can put stuff in there. I don't think it would be suitable for a bottle or anything like that, unless maybe you put the bottle in and then lost some room from the inside. The zips are as lovely as lounge fly zips are. And like the lounge fly bag as well, it doesn't have removable straps. That is what the Kingdom Hearts bag has. Again, let me know if you want me to show you the Kingdom Hearts bag I have inside and out because I think that could be beneficial for you if you're looking to purchase the bag. So that is successful and I think the seller did an amazing job. She was so lovely. I can't wait to go and take this bag for its first spin outside. I just think it's a really lovely look. My mum, when she saw it, I sent her a picture and she was like, it looks quite like an owl. 
and I guess she's not wrong. But if you have any questions about lounge flight, just let me know in the comments down below or anything about the bags in general. I'm always looking for good deals. I am also in a lounge flight group on Facebook, so if you're ever looking for good deals, I strongly recommend going and joining one of those groups because the people in there know what they're talking about. They're so helpful and friendly, and whenever there's an offer, they just post it straight away, which is so nice. I have to say, when I saw this bag, I had to get it. It's nice and it's gonna keep my mind off the fact that I'm no longer going to Disney in May. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, make sure you give it a like and subscribe if you'd like to see more. I'm sure there'll be plenty more lounge fly reviews on the channel as well as Disney hauls, tips and tricks for when you visit the park. Thank you again for watching guys and we will see you in the next video. Bye!